Derek Richardson from Euroflex, congratulations on winning the overall award. Um, you also won the innovator category. Can you just highlight what you're doing in your company that's particularly innovative in the area you're operating in? Right, well, let's say the business is completely focused on innovation and R&D. Um, we spent, let's say, a massive amount of time, both in terms of, let's say, sourcing particular types of raw materials, capital equipment, let's say, for delivering new solutions for food packaging and human supplements. So all the time, let's say, we would be working very closely with the likes of Lockery College or Queen's University, and we've got an ongoing pro program over, let's say, the next three years to continuously innovate new uh, packaging solutions to bring better convenience and better alternatives to what currently exists within the marketplace. And how much would you actually spend on R&D per year, would you say? It runs about 7% of our total turnover. So it's a, a very sizable, let's say, uh, amount of money, let's say, for, for a business of our size. There's 42 people involved within the business, and quite a few people actually are involved in actually taking responsible, responsibility for different aspects of what we do. So it's a, an ongoing program, right? It's primarily pitched towards export, right? So um, we work very closely with one or two companies in the States, in the Chicago region. So the idea is that we look at um, systems that we can go out there, buy innovation, bring it back, and modify to the European market. And in terms of then international internationalization and exporting in general, how are you doing on that front and what are your plans? Uh, let's say it's going extraordinarily well. Right? Let's say 37% of our business is now export, predominantly into the UK market and a bit into, let's say, Austria of all places, into the cheese market. Right? Um, it's going really, really well. Um, on the 21st of this month, we're back up for two more international awards. Um, they're European print awards. Um, so. We're the first Irish company that's ever actually achieved, um, let's say, awards in those kind of competitions. It's, it's a tremendous achievement. Fantastic. And what are your plans then, say, for the next year to five years? Um, the intention is, like every normal business, right, to try and grow. So we would expect that we'll probably double the turnover the business in the next three years. Um, we'll probably, well, we are going to make, let's say, very sizable uh, investments in capital equipment and also in systems. And I think, let's say, we'll probably announce another 15 employees, let's say, in the next three to four months. 15 employees, that's great. So what, what will that bring your workforce up to then? Uh, close to 60, yeah. Uh, let's say the new uh, employees, they're all sent around, let's say, production of food packaging materials for pet foods, right? So that's the area of growth that we see, and it gives us a good return as well. So it's quite exciting. <laughs>